Hey guys, it's Ellie from Elsie Bell's Bookshelf, and I am back today with some really gorgeous tassels to share. These will be in my shop. Um, I just decided to make them last night, and yeah, I couldn't stop. I have a whole bunch and some different themes and things, and so I'm going to show you them all. So the first one we're going to start with are the mermaid tassels. You guys know I love mermaids and mermaid journals, so I put these together. They are really, really thick. They are long. It's hard to tell on the camera, but they're gorgeous. So this one has a little charm that says mermaid at heart, and it's got this gorgeous um, sparkly blue and teal, almost kind of like yarn, I guess, but it's like in a trim form. Tons and tons of gorgeous sari silk. There's some eyelash trims. And also inside are hidden things. So this one has a beautiful little um, golden green and orange seashell and a little turquoise bobble. Also, there are some pearls in here. So just so fluffy and gorgeous. And here's the back. So there's that one, and they all come with a little clip at the top. So there's the first mermaid one. And I think I made like four ocean mermaid themed tassels. So here's the second. Really thick and luscious. It's got this gorgeous like resin mermaid tail. It's a little sparkly. And then inside there's these beautiful beads. And where's the other little so hidden. Then there's a little tiny little mermaid charm in there. So really beautiful. And then there's this one which is more ocean themed. It's got this beautiful gold gem at the top or um, trinket. Lots and lots of sari silk and trims. And this beautiful yarn again. There's some pink trim in this one some green and gold sari silk. You can see the the coloring on that. And then in the inside we have this beautiful bead with a little sea turtle and then another little shell. Oh gosh, they're just so thick and fluffy. I really wish you guys could feel them. They're so pretty. And then we have another mermaid and she has a, um, a blue resin tail, same trims and beautiful sari silks, all from Victorian Gypsy Girl. And then a beautiful bead there. And another little mermaid. So there's that. So these will all be in the same listing and you'll just choose uh, from the drop down menu. I'll have them numbered. Okay, so let's get into the nature. We have this one has lots of greens and golds and some whites, this beautiful crochet lace. Oh, let's see what else. Ooh, don't you just love that green? So vibrant. This beautiful wooden butterfly button at the top and this gorgeous leaf. And then on this trim it has a pretty rose gold rose. And that might be it. I think that's it for this one. So I put this charm up top. So there's Nature One. They're perfect for your journals. You can trim them down if they're too long. So here's another butterfly, your Nature One. has the beautiful green butterfly at the top. Lots and lots of sari silks. And this one also has, that one too, has um, some of that green fabric that I love. Strips of it. Some more crochet trims. There's eyelash trim, maybe not on this one, but, and then hanging off is this pretty gold leaf and this beautiful blue butterfly and a little gem right there. So there's this nature one, so fluffy. And then this one has a green dragonfly and this one has some like orange and green, yellow tie dye. Uh, sorry, Silk. That is not from Victorian Gypsy Girl. I forget the shop. But I'll have everybody linked as well. And then this one has the rose gold 
flower and a beautiful copper bead and a little green bead so there's that so they're all tied with um, flax linen thread and I all left the on all of them I left the strings long in case you wanted to add something else to them you could do that there's that one and then there's this one which is just white lace some beautiful purple uh, fabric and some white sari silk really really just gorgeous this could be like for a wedding journal a spring journal has another little rose gold rose and a pretty purple butterfly so there's that one okay and then this butterfly one has a lot of purples and pinks and greens just beautiful sorry silk that's been tie-dyed look at that gorgeous some more crochet trim it has some pearls some greens, this beautiful yellow, and some pink eyelash trim, and of course this gorgeous butterfly piece. It's a little see-through, which I love. And then so a wooden bead and a pretty like purple bead there. And then there's a tiny little silver butterfly inside there. So really luscious. Just ooh. Anyway, okay. So then I have a couple left. I have a farm themed, so it's got a lot of gingham, and this is actual um, vintage fabric that I got from an antique store. So I tore that into strips. This one too. Some crochet trim, also lots of sari silk. This beautiful red yarn trim that's a little sparkly. Uh, let's see, we have some spring spring type fabric here strips then I took some of those little uh, quilting squares I've been talking about and I stitched them all together with a vine stitch if you can see that and just made that into one long strip for the tassel Let's see if I can find the other side right here it's really really pretty we have some uh, maroon ribbon and then there's a little chicken there at the top there's a little thing that says blessed I got this from Heather this is from Alicia I think this is from Heather as well little piggy and then down at the bottom I put a little scarecrow and is there any more I don't think so so that's the farm journal tassel is really really nice and fluffy and then I made two unusual ones so I'm going to start with this one it is a Native American tassel I had this really pretty um, almost geometric shaped I mean fabric with those kind of shapes on it and so on this piece I did some stitching like trying to mimic the moccasin stitching. Put some wooden beads on there in different colors. On the top here, I have a beautiful uh, dream catcher with a little turquoise bead in the center. And this one is wrapped with some teal sari silk. Underneath it is still wrapped with uh, wax linen thread, but I just put the sari silk on top. So tons of sari silks, but that beautiful yarn, yellows, just see how much is in there and then I have this this is hanging off it's got a feather another pretty dream catcher with feathers on it has some feathers on it and this one and this beautiful turquoise piece so that is hanging off in the front of the tassel here so it would hang like this and let's see I know I put some more stuff on here I have this other little turquoise piece hanging and there is a arrow right here tucked inside so that is the Native American one this would go perfectly 
with my um, Painted Colors Kit, which is a Native American journal kit that you can download digitally. I can also print it out for you and ship it if you would like. So um, everything in my shop is buy to get free shipping. So you could get this tassel and you could get the Prince and Ships um, Native American kit and that would work perfectly. Okay, so I also have one more and it's a Peter Pan themed tassel. So we have the greens and yellows and reds and blues that are so, you know, kind of the theme in Peter Pan. And I also have this beautiful little Peter Pan trinket at the top. You can see them there. And then tucked inside, I have a mermaid, because those are pretty popular in Peter Pan. I also have the little um, clock button. I think I got this from Paulette. I also have two, um, what are these, bells tucked inside to mimic Tinkerbell flying around. I have the skull and crossbones for Skull Rock or the Pirates. What else? I have an arrow and a feather for the Lost Boys. I'm not sure if that's it or not. Nope. And I also have the moon and stars for when they um, wake up at night crying. So sad, but still, I put that in there. So it goes perfectly. So this is just gorgeous. So if anybody's making a Peter Pan journal, this is perfect. So there we go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you love these tassels. They'll all be in my shop. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.